And welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Fortress Craft Evolved in rush mode. All right, well, I'm clearing out a little space here. As you can see, we've got a little bit of space to work with, and that's good, because we need space. Getting a little cramped in here. Uh, crafted some advanced machine blocks. We need to get a refinery going ASAP, so I'm going to get a refinery controller. I'm going to get uh, as many vats as I can. And we are going to need, you know, some serious solar power to get this all working. Oh, look at that. I can actually make an organic. So let's do that. Oh, I don't have any resin. Never mind. Okay, so we need, we need a little spot here. Uh, so let's put a let's put a vat down Always put the vat always build just one even if you're gonna stack them just put one down first uh, And then the controller and then you can add more uh, okay, so let's, uh, I have 20, uh, three more. I'll do two up, and we'll go from there. Okay, yep. Three. Three more. And then on top, we're just going to slap in some serious amount of solar. So the first thing we need to actually make is um, why is this not getting any power? Anyway, first thing we need to make is some plastic. Uh, so I'm going to do Q, clear ore. I'm going to clear just a little bit of ore there. It'll clear those out, but I don't mind. Okay, so that's done. All right, we are cleared. Okay, so we need we need some plastic. So let's get. I want this is a remove, remove, add. This is already set to plastic, and now it just needs some biomass growth. And boy, do we have we have some biomass growth for this thing. Uh, so I'm gonna put one in there, one in there, and for some reason not connected to controller connected to the controller not connected to the controller so i'm going to break this i don't know what happened there maybe they built in the wrong wrong way no there it is I think when I built these, this one built first, and then this one built. So this one connected, but this one didn't have a controller to connect to. So now we are creating plastic. Let's see what our power is doing. Uh, it looks like we've got a net gain on power. So that's good. We we want that. These are removed. These are okay. Oh, no. Plastic pellet. Um, okay. Okay. So I put 200 in there. That should give me a hundred. That should give me a hundred plastic. Okay, so as you can see, our attack, our threat level is so high right now, 5,800. We are we are in boss territory, mainly because I'm researching, I'm getting the OAT uh, research done, and it looks like our power is actually a little a little questionable um we're, we're researching really really fast so that you know that doesn't help matters um but now we've got a reactor uh a vat going we're going to be able to make some progress here so if our if we look at the turbines you can see we have advanced machine blocks a lot of advanced machine blocks are going to be used so I'm going to want to then create a whole bunch of crystal clocks. 
lots and lots and lots of crystal clocks. Perfect. Oh, and we don't have... What's the power? See, one power per second? I actually think I can process all these without putting a solar panel on there. This is kind of crazy. And look, we've got our first blue eye. I picked that up a little bit ago. And just kind of keep an eye out for more. I, I uh, put a platform in here just for the bug drops because they were dropping all the way down there. And that's kind of annoying. So I kind of built this up here just to just to catch the drops for what it's worth not a whole lot I'm not seeing any pristine parts back in there the attack is pretty brutal I'm expecting to lose the attack I'm, I'm not concerned about that I just want to make sure we're getting some bug parts uh, I need those blue eyes for uh, the the better lasers because we're gonna want a lot of those ready to go okay so once this is done there's one more that I'm gonna need to do uh, to get where I want to go and that's the ultra power grid so it's gonna be quite a lot of tin and uh, let's see titanium and a few of uh, the copper so I've been trying to scoop up bars where I can and I've had to speed up both the tin and the copper here so it loads it fast enough and unloads it fast enough so that is that is really really the bottleneck for these two here because they're direct fed I mean they're coming right from the mine there's no cargo lift or anything so those are quite a bit slower and it looks like these are done so let's uh, reload this and I'm gonna want to reload this as well and we lost of course so that should reset our attack hopefully for a while uh, all right is this still going okay so 200 of those should give me exactly a hundred so I'm thinking we're gonna be right right in there yeah I think Exactly 100 is where we're going to stop. Uh, so let's just gather up the bars that we can. I could, you know, put a 2,000 slot hopper or something out there and really rack up some bars. But uh, we're going to automate the creation of the specific... Uh, advan or the experimental pods for each one of these tier 2 bars so once those are automated those those uh, smelters should keep pumping them out hopefully anyway all right so CPH is rebooted what's our timer set to now 42 minutes not too bad it's gonna give plenty of time for this to finish oh yeah this will finish very very quickly so let's let's uh, start the ultra power grid because this will unlock the mark IV battery and we're gonna need a few of these mark IV batteries one in each corner um, with a turbine so really maximize the power because these things are gonna produce a lot of power um, so I want ultra power grid 75 ultimate that is a lot um, which is a hundred and fifty and then times that by three is four hundred and fifty okay and then we have 75 simplified so the same the same dealio with simplified so that is one hundred 50 and then one two three four 50 and then the last one 50 basic oh basic is gonna be easy because that's just one one two three bingo okay so collect research OET research is done 
So let's grab... Oh, look at the forced inductions. We don't really need those. Uh, let's see. What else? Let's make sure these are unlocked. Uh, there it is. Orbital transmitter, orbital strike. And that's basically it for building the OET. Um, now, once this research is done, I'm going to move these setups one on each one of these ores over here. So titanium is going to get one, uh, gold is going to get one, and nickel is going to get one. And, it's, you know, I, I kind of want to research Spider Bro too, but I'm not really sure how much he's going to help later in the game. Because I think we're going to charge this thing pretty fast. Um... You know, 100 complex, 150 XL. That is, that's a lot. Um, but we need we need 32 massive eyes before we even have a prayer to get those. So uh, we don't have nearly enough. I think I'm gonna kick off another round of plastic. I want a, quite a lot of plastic to start. And. We may have to go down. Ooh, look at that, a stinger. Uh, we may have to go down and grab some more um, biomass. We may have to do that. So let's see, how many? We have 18 plasma cutter heads. Uh, let's see. One, two. That, that will give me 4,000. Uh, I want to make sure I have enough power. And other things to get this done. I kind of want to build a garbage thief too. That would be nice to have. I'm getting kind of cramped in my base though. Okay, where do I want to... It's, it's been a week since I've recorded last, so I don't know which, which pit I should go down. Um, I'm thinking nickel is probably... Uh, how, how far down does this go? I'm going to go down Titanium. I think it's close to Titanium. Heading down as fast as we can. No, don't slingshot me. The end is near. Okay. Yeah, I thought it was over here. Uh-oh. Okay, I think it was over, yes, it was over here, good. All right, so add power. Okay, oh yeah, I didn't, I never did scan this to see how big it was. I don't think anyway. 691,000. That is not bad at all. Um, I want to make sure we keep keep this thing rolling. Uh, as soon as this runs out, it will stop, so I don't have to worry about it going down. Um, these are the tier 3 ores, so they need a they actually need a cutter head to work. Oh, wow, he's out of power. I got the Twitter notification. Okay, let's keep adding power. I think one, you know... I think I'm able to power this thing through two plasma head cutters. And should be good to go there. So let's fill that up. And boy, is this thing, this thing is chewing through power. Wow. But I should be able to make it back with another 4,000. Pretty easily, because it's doing, what, 64 at a time? That was only 8. There was 64. That's weird. A 
little bit more power. Uh, a little bit more. Wow, look at that chew through that power. 400 left. Oh, that's the sound of Arthur running low on power. A little bit more. There we go. Drill stuck. Okay, that should do it. I got all of it. How much biomass do I want? 77.92, not bad. So let's head back up wherever we can here. All right, perfect. Gotta remember my my thing has a delay in it, so I gotta be careful. Look at that, we made it back. Now it's just a matter of zipping up the titanium line here, quick and easy. And we've got our Got enough biomass for quite, quite some time. All right, and this should stick to the cargo lift. It's kind of iffy. Okay, it's harder to get out. Oh, it's harder to get out where the uh, hoppers are because you bump your head on this and it's not, not easy to get out. Okay, so that plastic should be good to go. I'm gonna make some more. And let's see, our, I'm gonna make some more of these, which is there. Let's make some more, let's see, iron and nickel, make some more of those. And as far as crystal goes, we've got lots of crystal. So I don't mind making a bunch of those. I can go over here and grab a ton more crystal. So I'm not low on that. Six spider bro is kind of in the way here. There we go. There. Just like that. Another thousand or so crystal to, to use. All right, well, we now have tons of bars. Crazy how fast we got this setup going because now we are really, we are really cruising. Look at that. And grab some iron. Maybe a little bit of lithium. Don't use nearly as much lithium, uh, except when you're making mass batteries. Is this, is this working? Okay, yeah. Uh, let's kick off that research. I think this was it. Simplifying, okay, yeah, this was it. And that should get us going. I kind of want to get this research before before that 31 minutes is up because that will this thing is going to really ramp up our threat level. I'd like to keep that calm as much as possible because bosses come in and basically your whole base tries to kill them, doesn't kill them, loses. So I'd like to keep it low so we can keep keep the bugs coming in and killing them and getting the bug parts uh, otherwise the big bosses come in and end it for you so you don't have any more parts to grab so let's see what are we going to need um am i going to want to do any other research after this ah <sighs> 
missile defense. Yeah, I could. Yeah, I. Th I didn't think I was going to need missiles. I really don't. But you never know. You never know what's going to come at you. Because those bot I'd hate to get this thing kind of kind of up and running and then lose at the last minute. So I'm going to grab all of these and we are going to build ourselves a pipe Let's build two of these. Um, and then a couple, oh, we're going to need some more charged PCBs. So let's get these, I'm just going to, just going to max those out. Uh, because we need these fuel canister crafters to make fuel canisters for, uh, for our use, for the fuel that this thing is going to make. We're going to make a lot of fuel. I want to make some more iron plates. Let's see what, uh... Mark three laser. See, I need. Oops. Uh, let's see. Laser. Mark three. I need two perfect eyes for every laser and some conductive PCB. So after these uh, charged ones are done, I'll probably make a batch of conductive PCBs. Uh, so as we gain blue eyes, I will be able to build more and more Mark three turrets. But on the top. Right over here, we are going to create, I think, our first turbine. So let's plan for that here. Uh, turbine intake. And where is my housing? I know it should be close. There it is, right up there. Uh, let's... Uh, close that out. I don't know why I've got a stamper in my inventory, but it is what it is. So yeah, each side of these, each one of these is going to get its own turbine. And we're just going to manually feed the power into there for now. But uh, let's see. I want I want it to force that way. I don't want to burn myself. So let's just put these in front here. That way it blasts back away from the base. And we're gonna want a lot of turbines. So plan on having quite a few of these. That's why I'm sort of making so many, so much plastic and so many of the advanced machine blocks. Okay, speaking of which, we've got some more crystal clocks to go. Uh, all right, here, 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 here. And let's just keep making them too. I mean, uh, there's no reason not to. Because when, when it comes down to it, we're gonna have two hoppers here one is going to be remove, one is going to be add, and each each one is going to get a hundred hundred fuel, which means I'm going to grab the charged. We should be able to build now a couple of the fuel canister crafters. And let's see, I'm going to come over here and we're going to put a couple hoppers down. And we're going to have, let's see, I need the pipe extrusion plant. Uh, that's a stamper. There's the fuel. There it is right there. And then right after that, we're going to have the fuel canisters, just like that. And this, this obviously will have to be moved elsewhere. Okay. Uh, and let's put hopper here, hopper here. There we go. And this takes iron, I believe. 
yeah, iron pipe. So we need to put iron into this, which is why I've kind of been grabbing iron. So there's a there's a couple hundred pipes or uh, fuel canisters right there, ready to go into the turbines. So I'm going to continue this process, uh, making turbines. Uh, let's see, how many more can we make? One, two, three. And then one, two, three. So that will take care of my four corners, having uh, all of these ready to go. And from there, we are going to start crafting what we need, especially the OET components. Uh, so again, we're gonna want we're gonna want this facing away from us. So, like that. And then eventually we're gonna have Mark IV batteries up here. Uh, is that one, two, three, four, five? That's too many. like that and then of course oh that's a little higher than this one over here interesting I thought those were the same height okay so this is gonna be add only and this is gonna be remove only so just like that <clears throat> all the way around all right well that'll do it for this episode and I thank you for watching and I will see you next time <laughs>